What's up? This is Huron from Battlecross, and you're watching 3 Dot Mag. Hi, I'm Heidi. I play drums. Just kidding. <laughs> One of the vocalists. I'm Henry. I'm guitar. Go on, fucking rock that shit out. Yeah. We rock out the Pep Chop Boys because we can rock out any fucking song. You know, because it's funny. We go up there and we, you know, we may know. We technically, I don't know. I feel like we don't necessarily look metal. You know, we sort of look like average dudes because we've heard this before. You know, I've seen you guys get up there. And one time, someone said, "I thought you guys were like roadie setting up your this gear," and then all of a sudden, just you guys get up there and fucking kill it. And I love that. I love that we can sort of turn heads in that way and like expect this guy to fucking rock out that way. You know? Well, the vision is is this. The vision right. is just doing is is right. just is, going as far as as far as we possibly can. We all sacrificed everything to be here. Relationships, family. Houses, kids, I mean, everything. We, Jason's missing his daughter grow up, basically, and it's 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 a very difficult thing. You know, we've all lost a lot of things, but we gained this together. And you know, if, if every single person didn't have that drive and that vision and that sacrifice in them, it wouldn't work. None of this would work. We, I, you know, I've had this conversation actually just yesterday about how you know I just happened to run into. You know, four other people who were, who were just as ambitious as I was, and it never—it's never wavered since we started. Mm -hmm. Like it's never changed, and I think that's the only reason we're here is because we've, we've maintained that that drive. Things have been going great. You know, last year we had a, an exciting tour where we almost died every single night. Same thing's happening this time. I'm not sure that we don't know actually where Odorous is. I suspect he's smoking crack with a prostitute somewhere. I know he owes me a lot of money. The best advice is to just stick with what you're doing and, and love what you do and stay dedicated, stay humble, uh, work hard, and, and don't expect anything, man, really. You just gotta keep working for it and keep climbing through and keep climbing through. And well, like I said, if you love it, it's gonna be worth it and it's gonna be worth the struggle and, and uh, the, the dedication you put into it. So. It's true, and also I would say for new bands, you know, one big thing is just to find your way to stand out from the crowd. Whatever it is, think of a way to just separate yourself from the pack. It helps a lot to just find Musically, find whatever it may be. It's, it could be there's anything. so many bands out there right now regurgitating old shit, and which is good for them. It's what they want to do, by all means. But if you really want to stand out from the crowd, do something different. Do something a little write, different. Write something different. Write something progressive. Something that's going to stand out. Um, something people are going to fucking hate or fucking love. And connect with your audience, because that's where it's at. You know, you have to be able to connect with your audience. you got to be able to move people. you got to get people in those doors wanting to see. Wanting mm -hmm. to see. And so, create something compelling. That's really what it's about.